Alright, hey everybody, welcome back for part 84 of Let's Play Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix. Anyway, on the last video, we I just took care of some, you know, some random miscellaneous stuff while trying to get the ultimate weapon. And then I realized that I had to go, that I needed the, uh, that I needed the Remembrance material. So that's where, we're, so in this video, we're going to go through the Cavern of Remembrance. <clears throat> now, you may recall, I believe I showed this in an earlier video, but... Um, the enemies were pretty strong at the time. <clears throat> However, I, I'm all ready to take care of them now. Also, for, the, for anybody that's wondering uh, about if I'm fighting Sephiroth, uh, yes, I will be fighting them within the next few videos. Because at the, at the time of me recording this commentary right now, I literally, I just finished the main story. I just finished the main story, recorded the credits and everything. Now, one note about the credits, though. Um, since, uh, since, again, I've, I'm stuck with that 11 minute time limit, there's, there'll be like a little bit of a gap in the credits. Like, you'll, you'll see there'll be a gap between the end of one video and the beginning of the next. That's just because, you know, it took time for me to to stop the recording and then start the next one. So yeah, unfortunately I can't do much about that. Anyway, you might notice that um that the enemies here they look a lot like older enemies except that well uh, you may notice that they are stronger, but they also have a um uh, they're also pellet swaps. Now these are not the same enemies. They're completely different enemies. They have a completely different journal entry, um, and they drop remembrance materials. Um, you may have seen in the synthesis thing, uh, the remembrance materials are the ones that kind of look like the green arrow pointing down, and the ones that look like the mushrooms are the obviously the mushroom materials. I don't know what their name is. You know how you have like other ones is like blazing shard, blazing gem. I know that um, the ones in here are called remembrance, you know, remembrance gem, remembrance shard, but I do not know what the mushroom ones are called. It doesn't really matter though. Alright, but anyway, um, yeah, like I said, I've completed the main story now. However, this does not mean the let's play is done. Well, I suppose to, I suppose technically it is done. I just. I just have to do some, uh, the rest of the stuff is basically just optional stuff. Like, um, the, doing the Paradox Cups, um, doing the data rematches. Oh, by the way, here, these are the Remembrance Materials. I was, uh, in order, it was Stone, Gem, and Shard, in the order that I showed them in. That's what they look like. Another puzzle piece. Can't make it up there. My stupid level one glide. By the way, in some of the um, in some of the later videos, it'll be like the early uh, '90s. Like the the part will be like the parts will be like the early '90s parts, but. Um, yeah, in those parts, I I demonstrate some form leveling. Basically, I just show the where I go to do form leveling and basically like the route that I take. Because you know, like you'll go through various screens and then um, you know use the the safe circle to to warp out of the world before your drive gauge runs out. Um, I will be showing that for. I show that for the first four forms. I don't show it for final form because I already have uh, a couple, one or two videos coming up. Uh, the, it's, I already have a couple videos coming up that will be um, showing me leveling final form. And I made a notice these um, these balloons here. Uh, the color corresponds to what form you're supposed to use to. To get through there. Um, now, if you go into the corresponding form, then as you saw there, the um, it'll light up. Now you don't 
necessarily need to go into the form, like, I, I know for this one, for the wisdom form, you don't need to, you don't need to do it, and, um, you may, if you have final form up at a high enough level, you may not need to do that, but, um, and same thing with, uh, with the, uh, first one, the valor form, you don't, chances are you probably have a high enough high jump level by then. But um, the master form thing, I believe I have been able to do it with a le you need at least a level 3 aerial dodge. Because it will not work with a level 2 aerial dodge, I've tried it. Alright now, um, after all the at the very end of the Cavern of Remembrance, you do actually get a get bonus. Um, if I recall correctly, it is an item slot. So yes, yeah, Sora can get... Uh, what, is, what would that be? Eight item slots then? However, nothing for this fight. That just leads back... That, this will lead back to the previous area, which I will go to now. This leads back to another area here, which has um, this thing you can shoot out, which will um, it'll open that path up to you. And I almost fell off there because of Wisdom Forms lighting. Um, that looked like there was some Remembrance material there. And this is yet another area with another treasure chest. And yes, these things. Now I was kind of I was kind of pondering what I was supposed to do, but um, I think I figured it out. Uh, basically, um, these things are going to regenerate health. You just got to get them all down. And you do not hear a phone in the background. Alright, anyway, um... I got tired of Wisdom Form. I can't see what Keyblade I have equipped. I could probably tell by the sound, though. I believe it's Oathkeeper. That's me adjusting the laptop. That's not a Toshiba logo. Actually, it is. Yes, my TV is a Toshiba TV. It's like, what, 24 inches or something? That thing doesn't have any drive orbs in it, but this one does! I used Cure because, well, you gain more drive when you're in uh, MP charge. And there, as you saw, you only need... Um, you only need a level 2 quick run, because that's all I had. Um... Uh, now, like I said before, um, some of the later videos will be showing uh, what I did for form leveling. <coughs> I also show you, um, I will also be showing you guys a thing for uh, uh, summon leveling. Um, I only do like a little bit of it because it's, I, I only show like a little segment basically of like what the, what the basic procedure I guess is because it's very, very, very boring. It's the fastest way to do it, but it's very, very boring. Alright, now you use these things and go around here. Now you'll see that since I only have level 1 glide, I will not be able to complete the Cavern of Remembrance. Um, probably the next thing that I'm going to do in recording is come back here and I'll just 
I'll, I'll probably start the recording right at the um right at the um, the the place where you need to use glide at and you'll probably see it next video but uh, I yeah I, I will probably just uh, start recording then and then uh, you'll be able to see the rest of the cavern of remembrance hooray alright so there's a map and one of those new materials so after we get this puzzle piece right there uh, that's gonna about do it for this video so next part we're going to continue with the cavern of remembrance so as always uh, be sure to rate my videos and use the yellow button to subscribe if you like them and I will see you guys on the